we have questions and answers here and as you know this one is out of 100 marks section a has 25 marks uh, section b as you can see it has uh, 45 marks and then section c uh, you can see it has 30 marks uh, we request you to watch this video up to the end so that you can uh, benefit out of uh, our discussion today and you never know some of questions here can be repeated in uh, your kcse or the exam that you are waiting for maybe in uh, term one term two to term three or even in your cut uh, so if this is your first time to watch our videos kindly uh, subscribe to this channel and like this video to the subscribers we really want to thank you guys uh, for the support that you've given us to uh, section c that marks this is where you're supposed to answer two questions uh, uh, section b you're supposed to answer three questions and uh, this section c you're supposed to answer two questions question uh, uh, section a you're supposed to answer uh, all the questions the 17 questions or 18 depending on the exam and uh, you should answer all of them section a all of them section b uh, three questions section c which is this one you answer uh, two questions each 15 so number 22 you are told outline the composition of national assembly uh, it has 290 elected members representing constituencies 47 women uh, uh, women elected by registered voters of each county number elected i mean 47 women elected by registered voters of each county 12 members nominated by the parliamentary parties to represent special interest groups next the speaker who is an ex official member uh, 22b explain six merits of parliamentary supremacy in kenya merit of parliamentary supremacy in kenya it creates harmony as is executive and the legislature legislature work together number two the system is flexible since it in the case of emergency people may choose the leader from among the mps to end all crisis next it makes the cabinet act more responsibly as their actions are monitored by the parliament next it allows citizens to participate in a governing process by electing representative next it acts as a training ground for future leaders next it allows citizens to reject non-performing mps and elect those who can perform then the last one on this one uh, it allows for constructive criticism criticism for the opposition ends ensure ensures good governance let's go to question number 23 name three subordinate courts in kenya this one also is very common Manchester courts, but to the Kadi, uh, the Kadi courts, number three courts, uh, macho, then tribunals. Number 23B, 23B, you are told to explain six challenges facing judiciary in Kenya. This also is very common, and uh, they keep repeating challenges facing judiciary in Kenya. But one inadequate personnel leading to delays in the administration of justice and backlog of cases next external interference in the judicial process by other influential personalities next corruption in the court of law which results into unfair ruling next high court 
fees which limit public access to court next poor terms of service and working conditions of some members of judiciary make it difficult for them to administer justice next the use of outdated laws leading to miscarriage of justice and then the last one shortage of uh, equipment and facilities hinder administration of justice and then there is another one uh, it has emerged uh, with this um, bottom-up uh, regime the Kenya Kwanza the delay of salaries for the for the judges uh, Chief Justice OCJ was saying uh, some have not been paid for six months as we talk uh, question number 24 and 53 domestic sources of revenue for the county government in Kenya uh, three domestic three domestic uh, sources of revenue for the the county government in Kenya number one equitable shared national revenue number two county's own revenue number three conditional and unconditional grants from the national government next the loans from uh, the capital market the last one grant from local and external markets this question is also a very common uh, uh, you should master it because now we have uh, county government in operation you ca they can ask where do they get money or the resources uh, to uh, do their work let's go to this other question this is question uh, b that is 24b you are told to explain uh, six reasons why government of kenya prepare national budget annually why do we have to uh, to prepare a national budget each and every year uh, what is the reason for that number one it enables the government to explain to the public the tax structures number two it enables the government to source for revenue for its activities and programs next it enables the government to identify ways to spend its revenue without wastage next it enables the government to prioritize development needs in the country next it provides it provides valuable information to the people interested in investing in the country uh, this is where if the government want to invest in uh, a school or in education uh, people can now look at the opportunity of investing like now building of the the schools or maybe supplying materials next it creates confidence among foreign countries and financial institutions. Next, it enables the government to access it to assess it a performance in the previous year and improve uh, where possible. Next, it enhances accountability and the transparency on the side of the government in the eyes of the public next it ensures there is a balance in the country's revenue and expenditure ends avoiding balance uh, ends avoiding budget deficit next enables the government to set aside some funds to use in case of emergencies in a course of the financial year we are through with this video we thank you so much for watching up to the end uh if you have not yet subscribed to this channel i kindly take this uh, time this uh, take this opportunity one second or two uh, subscribe to this channel uh, like this video and it will be recommended to other viewers across the world also uh to the subscribers we want to thank them so much because this channel has grown this much because of your support today we request you one thing kindly uh, like this video and it, it shall be recommended to other viewers uh, until next time uh, goodbye